the goji sand really absorbs the heat quickly. Seeing was believing for Rob, who looked on in wonder and hunger as I transformed a pile of kale and tree bark into a delicious cannoli. Oh, oh, um, this doesn't even look like what you put in there. Right. Well, like, I'm losing my mind. What am I even? Now, it seemed unfair to deny other customers the chance to sample my magical treats, and so I attempted the trick a second time with Carol. And just a little dry dung fungus for flavor. <laughs> dry what? Dry dung fungus. Uh -huh. Yeah, it's mushrooms, it's pieces of mushroom. Okay, and that gets rolled up like this. Gotta do it nice and tight. Seals all the heat in. And just a piece of natural, I mean, you could use string, but we like to use everything that's natural here. So this is a natural twine. Gets wrapped up. And I use the tongs here like this. And then you just cook it over a, a heat lamp. I'm using just a quick bit on. It's light activated, so you never want to touch the goji sen and put your fingers anywhere near the bulb because it moves quick. And you'll Even feel that. It'll burn you. It'll burn you, yeah. Okay, gotcha. Yeah. And people do it on a low heat in a barbecue, or you could use a microwave, but it's a little bit too high tech for us here. You unroll it, be very careful. It's moist. Yeah, it makes a nice cannoli. Would you like to try that? There you are. Are you kidding me? It tastes a lot like a real cannoli. You put a piece of bark. Yeah. This? Mm -hmm. Gum, gum, gum bark. It has to be a gum tree. Yeah. You don't have any allergies, do you? Mm -hmm. Smells good, right? Isn't that great? <laughs> Tastes great. Where's the kale? The kale is emulsified by the goji sand into what represents like a cannoli cream. No way. I know. I mean, like hundreds of these. <laughs> what is um? Goji that? sand. You know goji what berries. Make, yeah. What makes it sweet? The goji? Uh, no, the cocoa bark, activated with the uh, dried dung fungus. What turned into this? Those, yeah, that's the pieces of the, of the cocoa no bark. Way. The little piece of sand will emulsify it. So, take the recipe home, you know? And then the little kit. Yeah, I'll see if I can get you a kit. Just hang tight, I'll get that for you. You know, I think I might have a future as a diet guru.